I'm Zainab Mian. I'm the author of My Friend the Alien, which is a brand new book, part of the Bloomsbury Readers series. It's about an alien called Max, who's a real alien landed on Earth from the planet Zerg. Now on Zerg, nobody has feelings and emotions. So they've sent Max the alien down to Earth to try and find out what emotions are and why humans have so many different emotions. He makes a great new friend called Jibril, and they have lots of laughs together because it is a funny book. Um, but what Max can't figure out is, why some of the humans think that Jibril is an alien and they call him an alien just because he's from another country. So anyway, eventually, um, Max starts developing very real human emotions of his own, which are triggered by feeling empathy for his friend Jibril and by an unexpected challenge to get back home. So it's a really, really funny book. I hope you have fun reading it and have fun looking at the really beautiful illustrations inside. Really funny and beautiful illustrations. And they're done by a lovely illustrator called Sernur Izik, who lives in Turkey. Um, I do hope you enjoy it. And I'm going to read a section for you to show you what it's like inside. So I'm going to read to you from day four of Max's time on Earth. The way that the book is written is that it's written in the little reports that Max sends home every day to Planet Zerg to tell them about how his day has been. So, day four. I made friends with one of the humans today. Yes, yes, I know I am breaking the rules. I'm only supposed to look at them and not touch, blah, blah, blah. But it spoke to me. And anyway, I need help. I can't complete this mission by myself. It's too much work for one Zerglid. It happened in one of those buildings full of all the things where humans go to get the stuff they want. I was walking past the books and magazines. They have those just like we do. I saw one called Aliens from Outer Space. Hey, that must be about us, I thought. And then I couldn't believe what I saw. They had drawn us green with antennae and we had no clothes on. Do they think we have no shame and green? Who told them we are green? Basically, they think we're pretty ugly and slimy looking. So I was standing there holding the book, gaping and gasping with disbelief. When the human came up to me, it was a medium sized one, not big and not small and tiny. And it said, aliens are cool, right? But pretty ugly. So I said, no, we're not. The human smiled and said, we? Do you mean you are one or something? And I said, yes, and I'm not ugly. I look the same as you, actually. The human laughed and said, you're funny. My name's Jibril. I'm named after an angel. So I said, my name is Max. I don't know what I'm named after, but it's probably an alien. The human laughed again. His eyes were sparkly when he laughed and his face looked nice better than humans look when they're shrieking. Then he asked me if I'm going to the All Things Alien exhibition at the library. I said, of course I am, because I love aliens. And he said, he'll see me there at lunchtime tomorrow. I think I'll learn a lot from Jibril. When I walked out of the building, I saw two male humans fighting about which one could put their vehicle in a space on the road. I guess they haven't learned to zap shrink their vehicles to save space like we do. This was an interesting thing to watch because it was the first time I saw the anger feeling. I didn't know humans can change colour, but it happens when they get angry. Both of these humans were going red. One of them threw their cup of brown liquid at the other one's vehicle, which made him jump out and thump on the window of the first one's vehicle. It ended up with both of them punching each other in their red faces and they didn't stop until a short, wrinkly human that moves extra slowly came and started whacking them both with her handbag. So basically, feelings are flying around everywhere and humans don't seem to be able to control them. And did I mention, they think we're green. So I hope that you enjoyed that chapter 
from My Friend the Alien, which is written by me, Zainab Mian, and illustrated wonderfully and hilariously by Sir Nur Isik.